game two of the best of three one-day series between Australia and Pakistan. The Aussies lead 1-0 following a dramatic win at the MCG. Can they wrap it up today or will Pakistan force a decider? It is all set to unfold right here on Fox Cricket. Great to have Adam Gilchrist and David Warner alongside me. Waiting for Shaheen Shah and Short. Positive start, driving straight down the ground. The boundary's in a little bit today in Adelaide, which is something unusual. And Short starts the innings absolutely beautifully. He's got that square. He's got the under edge of the bats up. The opening boundary. Width cut. Save your legs, Jake. Save your legs. Again, perfectly timed. That is a glorious cricket shot. Off the back foot, just punching it. Oh, there's another one. That is an absolutely picture-perfect cover drive. First in that gully. Real interest there. Crashes into the pads, and Shaheen Shah of Reedy knocks over Fraser McGurk. Fraser McGurk goes for 13. Bright start, but some shake from Shaheen Shah. Pretty good decision not to review that. Yeah, it's hitting middle and probably pitched on leg. Picked up on a length. There's a man there. Straight to him. Oh, Freedy. He had it. That we said the man should be. He's made early yards there. And it's just gone straight through his hands. He'll be extremely disappointed. With... Picks it up. Doesn't completely time it, but hits it well enough through mid wicket to get to the boundary. Oh, gee, hit it hard. It was uppish. Good luck getting your hand on that, though. Now flows into a drive. So a couple of boundaries to finish the over from Stephen Smith. Australia travelling nicely. Straight to him. Just hammers it straight to point. Bubba takes the catch. This one to hit through the offside. Hits an aerial. So a bit of a thick edge. That's a sharp chance from Bubba. It's an awkward height where you're not sure whether to go fingers up or fingers down in the end. He went cricket as well. Just eases that. Didn't overhit the ball. Nice, says Witt and Smith. It's not big foot movement from him, but it's time that. Wow, that's just... It was depends. Up oh. through the hands of uh, backward point and gets through to the boundary as well. You are the, one of the best fielders in Pakistan saying, you've got to have these catches. Yep, it's a drop catch. And helped around the corner all the way. The biggest boundaries ever here, but the ease with which he executes. Oh, a noise. And they like it, and that's why it's been given. Through to the keeper. Was it straight off the glove? It's a nice, simple catch for Rizwan. Diving down. Outside edge. Ralph breaks through again. He's got Marnus for the second time. Harris Ralph's got two and Australia lose their four. Got the false shot there from Marnus Labuschagne. Little tickle there. Rizwan takes that with ease. And Harris Ralph has taken another wicket here for Pakistan. Yeah, that's going to be a boundary. It's nice fast hands. There was enough with edge there. He's gone. Didn't take long. So maybe a little bit of justice for Mohammed Hasnain. Just a little bit of extra, but look how wide it is. A bit of extra bounce, simple catch for Rizwan. And immediate effect from Wreck-It Ralph. Look, beauty, he says, indeed. Oh, look at this length, look at the same position. A little away uh, from the right-hander edge and a very good catch from the skipper behind the stump. So three for 21, Haris Ralph. In. And he shot his bowl him, played on, stumps everywhere. Harris Ralph destroying the Australians. He's got four. With two men out, I, I'm not sure it's a, a real high percentage shot to be looking to pull Harris Ralph. I'd be looking just to knock him on the onside into the gap. Maxwell's an aggressive player. Edged, another one for Rizwan. He's taken five catches. The team's got a wicket, and Australia are collapsing in Adelaide. 20, 38 runs, and uh, was going across, back of a length, playing away from the body, edge, an easy catch. He's such a good keeper. Oh, he's done that. He's done more than pat it back. He's whacked it over mid on for a big 
six. There's a nick there. Is there certainly a noise and confirmation from the umpire? Cummins is going to send it upstairs. So they were. Thank you. If we could go back to the uh, on-field umpire, Gaff, you can stay with your original out decision. You can sit on now, thanks. Dragged on. So it all finishes. The man who started it, Shaheen Shah Afridi, picks up the last. It is his third wicket of the innings. Pakistan, somewhat of a topsy-turvy polling. And sent Australia in, they were able to bowl out the host nation for 163, primarily on the back of five for 29 from Harris Ralph. But now the challenge is to get out with bat in hand and initially negotiate this opening spell. It's a pitch that has a certain amount of seam and sideways movement. We're all set. 164, the chase. A bit of shape, but it came right out of the middle of the bat too for Sam Ayub, and he'll uh, open the account with a, a nice two. Into the gap, beautifully timed. Don't have to run too much for those. If, uh, oh, oh. That's fine, that's extra. Oh, could be tight if he picks up cleanly. Oh, he did, and it's going to cost him four runs. Quite get the throw on line. It was uh, probably worth the risk, Jake Fraser. Mc oh, that's better. Confident punch. And he'll reap four for that nice bit of footwork. It'll be the big sigh of relief. Comes to Ayub. Charges! That's the shot of the evening. Just sliced it away. A bit of momentum going Pakistan's way. Well, lost in an accident with a sibling, didn't he? That's a nice stroke. High elbow. That's a beautiful shot by Lula Shafiq. Moves to 20. None for 43. Another beautiful shot. Similar result. Pakistan just starting to move nicely here. Boundary starting to come. And Australia under pressure. Picked up nicely by Ayub. Perfectly timed. Four rows back. Valiant effort in the crowd. Don't think he held it. Ayub and Shafiq. That's beautiful. That's a bit of Dave Warren, that one, actually. Got the hip, the front leg up. Nicely punched down the ground. He offered him the drive, did Cummins. Long chase in this beautiful outfield from Hardy. Well and truly past the 50 partnership now. Oh, that's a shot. That is a shot and a half from Sam Ayub. Oh, jeez, flick that. Miles back here in Adelaide. Ayub's starting to really roll now. On the hip. Into the outer. Pat Cummins, over before. Uh, this one's a bit fuller. to flick. More of an up and under shot, wasn't it? It wasn't a pull shot. It was a... Into the attack. That is picked up once again. Again deep, 15 or 20 back, and Ayub continues on his merry journey. That was his third sixth. Pressure back on the bowler and to Australia. Look at that shot. Well, as he played this stroke, I saw it going into the stands, and it looks over how he shouldered. Oh, charges, slaps it, and he is dropped! Zampa had it in both hands and then tried to do a Mark Taylor, kick it up with his feet, but it didn't quite pay off. Kind of a scene when you see Australian fielder dropping a catch. It wasn't a difficult one either. Guided down for a single. Same Ayub with his maiden one day international 50. He does it in fine style in absolutely the perfect moment. Almost run a ball. First 50 for this youngster in his second ODI for Pakistan. What a That's lovely. Beautifully pulled away. It's not a great delivery at all. But uh, the flow continues to be in the favour of Sam Ayub. Again to the leg side. Enough on it. Yes, there is. That brings up the 100 for Pakistan without loss. It's his fourth six. Really is a classy innings from Simon you that was his fourth six. That's a beautiful stroke. It may have been the wrong one, but it's met with complete disdain. Fifth six of the innings for the young left-hander. Every minute out there, it was a leg break. He played it inside out. 
and the fielder at Medoff was uh, up in the circle. So he picked up that shot. Whack. Oh, deal with that. A 6-6. Six, six. Fetch it. What a shot. Yeah, taking the time to shine on the international stage. That, as you mentioned, Vaughny, anything with any length, any leverage underneath, he is going to... Oh, he's in a hurry now as well, Abdullah Shafiq. That's a wonderful blow. Adam Samper on the receiving end here. He's under siege from a Pakistani opening pair. Just a little punt that. Nice length, gets down low. Oh, he touched it, I meant. Exactly what he does, but some thick outside edge that brings to an end a wonderful inning. Zampa. He gets his man in the end, but it's been a tremendous wrestle for him and an Australian bowling lineup. Another six. It's been no shortage this evening. Shafiq with another. His third. Pakistan can't ring to victory. Short one. Baba pulls it away for a six to finish. A wonderful night for Pakistan. They destroy Australia by nine wickets with 20 plus overs to spare. They level the series at one apiece going to Perth and it's the first time Pakistan have had a win in a one day international in this country since 2017 on the back of some wonderful batting and 10 sixes.